The Mediterranean climate emerged a few million years ago at least, and with it came dry, hot summers and more frequent fires. Throughout the history of the Mediterranean, plants were burned by fire and they have developed different strategies to survive. Although fires are known as destructive, if you visit a site soon after the first rains following a fire, you will find it full of life. The first and oldest strategy in the face of fire is used by species we call resprouters. These plants can be entirely burned and quickly regrow from buds they protect with thick bark or often underground. Over time, some species evolved a new strategy, the ability to store a fire-resistant bank of seeds whose germination is stimulated by the temperature or the smoke of the fire itself. These species that we call cedars evolved in a time of expanding aridity and so are also adapted to drought. Today, climate change is rapidly striking Mediterranean regions. We have less rainfall, higher temperatures, and higher atmospheric CO2. The world has watched as drought and heat waves have exasperated massive fires in Southern Europe, Australia, and in California. In this new scenario, some species will be able to adapt in the short term, and others will not the outcome of which will be the future of biodiversity in Mediterranean ecosystems. I am Maya Zomer and I am doing my doctoral thesis on plants, fire and climate in the Desertification Research Center in Valencia, Spain. I want to understand how plants currently cope with variable environments, which strategies will be advantageous under future climate and which species will have the most potential to adapt. To respond to these questions, I carried out experiments in the field along the Mediterranean coast of Spain to study gradients of aridity and fire in relation to resprouters and plant communities. Experiments in the laboratory of germination under effects of temperatures and experiments of CO2 and drought in greenhouses we built ourselves. My studies and many others demonstrate that fire is an essential part of Mediterranean ecosystems and that plant species do show the ability for quick adaptation if we can keep the severity of climate changes within their limits.